This algorithmic price action gave you high probability levels to trade off that you should be able to spot and trade with my DR basic teachings. Let's break it down. This is the crude oil futures market price action from Tuesday. We start with the ADR session, which is being supported by previous RDR highs and closing as a green DR box, where the closing price is higher than the opening price. We get our long confirmation one hour later at 9.30 pm, giving us higher probabilities for bullish price action throughout the DR session. Price rejects the ADR high three times. This is where we look for a trade, if around 3R is possible. We have some previous WIBs and the closing price sitting below current price action, which should be considered to be covered with our stop loss. The trade would look like this and let's see how it would have played out. Unfortunately, price didn't reach the 1SD level and the session is over. The ODR session starts and is currently being supported by the ADR mid, the opening price and an volume imbalance that has been created with the opening of the ODR session. Price pushes higher and the ODR session confirms longs with a higher probability for the session. We obviously want to look for longs, but what makes the confirmation candle already very special? We have the ADR lows still intact. More important is that the confirmation candle took out the ADR session highs, and with that it also created a higher high. That are first signs for a potential upside expansion model. Price returns back into the DR and rejects the ODR mid to the tick. What else do we have that should convince you to take your first bullet for the session here? We have the ADR high supporting price and an open magnetic whip right above us, so we can at least expect a little push higher or ideally new highs. If price goes lower, we can take our second bullet, since it would be anywhere in the retirement area. Target would be the next SD level of 1. Always check if there are some extra confluences to the left, like a previous DR level or an open magnetic volume imbalance like here. You can enter with the next candles opening and place your stop 2 to 3 ticks below the IDR mid. Price push is higher and we leave another open whip here. One hour before the session ends we get even more rejections from the IDR mid. Either your stopped out break even here or you should consider another entry. Why? Look closely. It's this open magnetic volume imbalance here. The ODR session is almost over and we reach the target of 1SD and also closing the old open WIB. Beautiful upside expansion so far, creating higher highs and respecting the previous session low. Here's another open magnetic WIB. Now we are coming to the RDR session and we get an immediate long confirmation with a green RDR box. All three ODR levels are intact and we are creating higher highs across all three sessions. Notice that there are no open magnetic whips inside the range. This is already a trade opportunity but more of an advanced one here. Let's wait for more confirmations. Do you see a trade opportunity here? Absolutely. Potential return into this whip can give you a great opportunity with the stops 2 to 3 ticks below the IDR high and the closing price of the RDR box. Our target for this trade would be the one standard deviation, since the low hanging fruit target of 0.5 would give us less than 3R. And here we go. Price reached more than two standard deviation at the end of the day. Picture perfect upside expansion model and several trade opportunities with just the DR basics that I teach here for free. Like the video if you want to see more of these breakdowns and if you are interested in learning more about the DR trading strategy and get access to advanced tools and unparalleled knowledge about the market, then visit m7dr.com.